Dick Enberg, the great announcer, uh, always said that some of his best ad libs were written down. And the championship to New, New Jersey, the Devils win the Stanley Cup was written down on the back of my scorecard because I didn't want a moment like that if it came that day to pass without some mention of the state of New Jersey because there hadn't been a championship team from New Jersey before uh, in sports. And so um, that was the reason that that was worked into a, a definite line that I wanted to have written down so that I didn't blow it. Al Michaels, who's one of my great colleagues and has always been so kind to me, uh, made it difficult for all of us in this business, didn't he? Because he came up with lines that will never be, you, you will never improve on what he did in 1980. It was magnificent the way he finished off. Uh, do you believe in miracles? Yes. Uh, how are you ever going to top that? And this impossible dream has come true when they beat the Russians. I mean, uh, and, and the, the miraculous way of, of finishing uh, that game against the Soviets. And then, and then when they actually clinched the gold medal the next day, because on the final day, they could have not medaled at all. Uh, and they wound up uh, winning the gold. So he had those two wonderful lines at the conclusion of two games. And none of us will ever approximate that because the gravity of the games that we're doing it will probably never reach what was going on at that time. Uh, but we all try to at least make a statement if we have the time to do it and the game is lopsided enough. The many one goal games that I've done in Stanley Cup clinchers, uh, you just simply say the, the winning team has won the Stanley Cup because it's usually frantic near the end with the goalie pulled in a one goal game. And so you don't have the luxury of relaxing and building as we did with St. Louis in game seven over Boston and going back over what all they'd accomplished in the final minute you have when it's evident they're going to win and the bench is celebrating and they're showing those shots that they had uh, changed coaches in November, that they were terrible right after the coaching change, et cetera, et cetera. So that's a long exposition and I'm sorry for that. <laughs>